space probes like Curiosity that's on Mars at the moment, that's really cheap uh, compared to sending people to Mars. And so quite often the scientists who want to find out about the world will say, well, we should spend it on robots. We shouldn't spend it on people. I think crude space exploration is in, in some ways, I mean, it's clearly true at the moment that humans can do more than robots so we can explore the place better. But, but I think it has to be, it's about something else. It's about living and working off the planet, which I think is quite a persuasive argument, actually. We've, we've already industrialized near-Earth orbit, so it's already a multi-billion mm. dollar industry, you know, communication satellites and weather satellites, GPS, whatever. You know, we're already up there. And so learning to live and work in space is, I think, a natural extension of our of our civilization. Plus the fact if you talk to Elon or Jeff Bezos, they point out that the, the amount of resources available just slightly above our heads is vast. And so I, I remember I talked to Jeff Bezos actually once and he, he thinks really simply and he said, you know, for example, in the asteroid belt, there's enough metal, I think, to, to build a skyscraper. What is it? Eight, eight, something like 800 stories tall and cover the earth in it, right? <laughs> if you want. Now we don't want to do that. But his point was that, that the energy from the sun is all up there, the resources are up there. So you could almost imagine trying to zone the earth residential at some point in the future to protect the planet and do your heavy industry off the planet, for example. And th these sound, it sounds like science fiction, except that now SpaceX and Blue Origin, those people have got reusable rockets. So suddenly the economics become sensible. I think expansion is good. And I think we will expand, and I think we will expand outwards, because there's not much room left on this planet to expand. That's a whole different idea. It's, it's not about gathering scientific information. It's about a frontier and, and all the benefits that come from operating as a civilization on a frontier, which we've sort of lost on the Earth because there is no frontier left. And so I like that idea. You talk about Mars, especially with Elon. He's right that that's the only place you can go. So there, there is no other planet we can go to other than Mars. Uh, you can't go to Jupiter or Saturn. You right. can't go to Mercury or Venus. So if we want to go somewhere and expand our civilization, it has to be Mars. And everything's there that you need. So, But that, that's a different thing to saying you want to find out stuff. You're right. If we just want to find out stuff, then you send robots.